Hey, what's up, guys? Dr. Lego Nation here, and today we're going to be reviewing another Ninjago set. This is set 70505. It's recommended ages from 8 to 14, and has 565 pieces, and this is the Temple of Light. I know what a lot of you want to pick this set up for. You either want to pick it up for the Golden Weapons, or the Golden Ninja himself. Um, he does say it comes down here, but, and it also comes with the Overlord. But, so, on the front of the box here, it shows how it's got the top half of the Temple of Light. There's pretty, a pretty good look at his mech. Looks really cool. Then there's a little epic battle going on between the Stone Warrior and him. Um, on the top of the box, it just shows the top of the temple. It looks like it comes with the archer and the swordsman. Down at the bottom, it looks like it comes with a lot of weapons and stuff. And it has Gold Ninja included over there. So we're going to go ahead and look at the back of the box. Alright, on the back of the box here, we're going to adjust the light. Um, it shows a little thing of the mech. Then it shows um, how the mech can fit inside of the temple and has the temple open. Shows down here it comes with all four elemental weapons and shows that girl not going down there. And so there wasn't really much to the box even though it was, looks amazing. So we're going to go ahead and open it up and build it. Alright, and the first minifigure we get with this set is the none other than the Golden Ninja. And I know this is the reason you want this set. I don't blame you, because this guy is really, really detailed. And um, I just love the nice golden color on him. Um, he does have a little bit green left on him, if you can see, which is pretty amazing and then if you take off his head his head is golden as well you just get the Lloyd head with the smiling side it's not double sided sadly and then here's the helmet everything is golden and then if we take his head off then it reveals his dragon emblem which is excellent and um, I just love the front torso printing and uh, so this set is very exclusive to this set so we're gonna go ahead and move on to the others the next guy we get here is one of the uh, like scout stone warriors or such but this guy is very cool I'm loving his front torso printing he also doesn't have the posable legs because he is the scout. And uh, he does have the quiet. Uh, love the new face printing too. That can be used for a lot of customs. And he comes with this red Sensei Wu hat. And uh, does not have a double sided face. I can see why. And then once you put this on, it kind of shadows him over. But it comes with this red quiver. And does have a hint of back printing as you can see from the behind. Uh, so, this guy, definitely worth it. Gonna move on to the others. Then we've got the actual warrior. And uh, he does have back printing, but he does have the posable legs. And this armor piece, which I'm loving. This is basically what was on the back of the other figure. The other figure, which is excellent. He comes with a black katana sword. Um, would have thought this came better. But he does come with the blue face printing, which that can is still, again, be used with a lot of customs. And has the same torso printing. But let's hurry on and get on, man. And then, of course, we have the evil and possessed Lord Garmadon. Uh, first, what I want to start off with is the helmet. It is the most unique thing for the, with this set. 
it's uh, the samurai basically just more menacing and evil and this is basically the overlord but they call him possessed Garmadon and this piece does separate from the original Garmadon thing so that's nice and uh, let me fix this real quick just gets a little annoying because sometimes it won't go back on but yeah and it's got even the little fangs and then as you see it's just the forearm garment on we get in destiny's bounty so then you put on this and boom and then on here we also get the little claw piece it's basically his staff a lot comes with this minifigure I'm really glad that it did and really really cool figure have to go have to go pick this guy up and this is the only set as of now or this is the only set you can get him in so let's go ahead and move on to the last minifigure and get on in the set our next minifigure here is the just regular old sensei Wu. we get him in a multiple sets except this time he comes with a golden thing not very special there's nothing really special about this figure, except he comes with a golden staff in this. So, this was the only figure I wasn't impressed that they put in this set. Too bad, Sensei Wu. Ah. Alright, guys, and then we have the mech here, but we have to go by him in sections because my camera doesn't have a good width range. But we're going to start at the top. Very detailed, and it's very articulate right here. And that part comes off a lot. <laughs> because Lego didn't give me the right pieces. But still, very articulate on these joints, kind of like bionicle pieces. And then we've got this very, very detailed top. Um, comes with a little golden since a woo hat. And then there's a big one. And the good thing about this thing is it's printed. So that's very nice. This comes back and stuff. And then, basically what this thing is for, is for the Golden Ninja that you can put just right here. Then you can pretty much just close him in there. And it's got these two golden uh, things that you get in the J Stormfighter. Has a pretty nice chest piece on the back. Just a little thing to hold this up. And then, I'm gonna go ahead and lower down just a little bit. Just here, just articulate right here. Mm, nothing very special. This part does not move. The feet do, but this doesn't. And it looks like these right here can be turned into flight mode. So, overall, I really like the mech. It's very fun to play with, but and very big stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and put that over there. And then we're gonna move on to the set itself which you're gonna have to lower down to do the bottom. Alright, on the bottom level here we've got this. It's very detailed. Um, this can open up which is very nice. We've got a little weapon holder over here, some lamps off to the side, some printed pieces back there, and I was too lazy to put the stickers on, but it does come with stickers, as you saw in the box. And here's a little fireplace, which is really, really cool. And then what they added exclusively in the set was this little gong, um, which is really nice because uh, it's got a little holder and you and it's golden as well so this is the temple of light so it's to be very 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 golden and then on this side we just have the same thing pretty much with a random plant it's kinda weird and then these can come out which is really nice so we're gonna go ahead and move up a level on this level we've got these little ladders right here which is very nice if you want the um, these guys to like be storming up the castle and as you may have noticed it came with all four new 
elemental weapons, fire, fire, lightning, earth, and ice, which is very cool. And that's very nice, and that's probably another reason you want to get this set. But there is only one, pretty much one play feature to this set. Um, if you see this little red piece under, all you have to do is pull this out from under this. Maybe push it down, and he's gonna like fall down, and uh, he's gonna like fall down, and like if he's trying to steal the weapon. And then also, it's got this little golden spike, so if it also falls down, it's gonna like chop his head off, which wouldn't be very good. It's like, no! And then up here, we've got these little dragon pieces. Nothing very special. No play features up there. And then, the last thing I wanted to show you is the reason this closes up is so if you want to make it nice and compact so it doesn't take up too much room you can just put the mac in there and this set was about seventy five dollars at walmart i think and it does come with a whole bunch of extra pieces like these uh... exclusive swords but overall i'm gonna go ahead and give this a ten in this set so i'm gonna go ahead and end off the video and i'll see you later guys